Good morning, you guys. It is a Friday and it is going to be a fun day. So I thought I would do a quick vlog. I just got back from walking with a friend of mine. We walked from six to seven. So it's just a little after seven right now. Um, we, we meet at a lake and we walk around a lake. So it was gorgeous and geese totally flew up off the water and scared me to death. It's not a normal day. And the reason for that is my middle son is actually with my parents. So they live about six hours away from us. So they took my son and his cousin who is about his same age and they took them down for like four days to their farm. And so they are having a blast. I just FaceTimed him last night and he's having so much fun. Um, but then my daughter actually has a birthday party and she's going to be gone most of the day today. So it's just going to be my oldest and myself. Um, so it'll be a fun day. I think we're going to maybe try and meet my husband for lunch. And I have a bunch of, um, I'm a classical conversations director. So I have a bunch of errands to run for that. Uh, so yeah, I just thought I would take you along with me on our day. Just finished the first part of my morning and that included drinking my shake, having my quiet time, and <clears throat> I was listening to an audiobook actually. It was called Managing Oneself by Peter Drucker. And I really like um, Amy, oh, I forget her name. It's Amy TV. I'll link her down below. She has a great YouTube channel. And I really like her like calendar blocking. I mean, it's not like her idea. <clears throat> but she has lots of great videos on how to calendar block. And I really, really like that in order to get everything done that um, I need to get done for CC and for homeschooling and for all of that. So I really, really like, um, I really have liked her videos. They've been extremely helpful and beneficial to me in getting things done. So um, I will link my favorite calendar blocking video below. Uh, I do need to go get ready real qu really quickly. And then we are going to do some school. These kiddos just got up and they are working on their math. How's it going, girl? Good. How cute is this little birthday party invitation that my daughter got? It is the cutest thing. So this is the birthday party she's at today. And they get to go to a beauty college and get their hair and nails done and maybe a little makeup. So she is beyond thrilled. Okay, I'm back in my van looking a little more presentable now. I am just about ready to go to the church to meet with um, the child care workers that we are going to have this fall for Classical Conversations. Just another errand and thing that um, needs to be accomplished before CC begins next week. And uh, yeah, so that is where I'm headed. Okay, I just finished up at church. I'm going to lock my van. And now I'm headed into Office Depot. I need to make a couple copies and run a few errands. What'd you say? You got Coke Zero? Yeah. Ew. We met this guy for lunch. Raisin canes. It tastes like syrup. Ew. I've never had it. Are you full? Give daddy a big hug. <laughs> Didn't have to tell him twice. Aww. Do you like having mommy and daddy all to yourself? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this guy talked to his brother for how long today? Did he call you twice? Yeah, he misses you, doesn't he? I have my helper here. We are going into the library because I accidentally forgot the DVD last time I was here. So I have to drop that off. And hopefully they know where the case is. So I just got home and I got this fun pink Ipsy package in the mail. I'm always excited when I get that. Um, this, These things fell out first. So I put that I love these masks because they just hydrate my face so well. And I'm really, um, I'm kind of stockpiling them for the winter time. Um, but I really love them, so I'm glad they sent me a couple more of those. And then I got like a little blush brush. And then this is a cute little bag. It's a material, which most of the time, I don't think I've ever had a material one. Um, but it's always so fun. I always take the sneak peek and see what I'm going to get. But um, anyways, this is, what is that? 
oh, it just talks about that stuff. But anyways, this is a blush and it's a really pretty, like, I think it's like a duo color, you know, where they kind of have two in one. And yeah, I really like this Pixie brand. Like this, I have repurchased actually, not the blush in particular, but there was an eyeshadow that I repurchased. It was actually one of the ones that I left when I went to Florida. Sad day. Uh, then this is a cleanser. So I really like these. They're fun to try at night. I actually just put a little bag together. I used one of their bags and I put like all of this stuff that's meant for nighttime, like masks and things like that. I mean, obviously these big old masks don't fit, but, um, I put all of this stuff in there and it's kind of fun to pick and choose each night what you're going to use to wash your face and scrub it with. So, um, and then this is like a liquid matte, lip gloss. So that'll be interesting to try. I'm not usually a huge fan of lip glosses, so I'm excited to see if I like this one or not. Okay, we are doing our Mission World Wonders. And this is the geography song. If you can hear that. But uh, this is really cool. I love it. We have enjoyed this so far. This is our second week, the end of our second week. And so Roman is tracing the northern parts of Africa, the northern northern countries. And I think it includes, what, the Mediterranean and the Canary Islands on that one? Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we are absolutely loving this curriculum. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. So we're going to read a little science. We're going to read some window on the world and um, probably listen to a little story of the world. Um, cause we didn't do, well, we didn't read all of our science yesterday. That's right. So we do have a little science to add for today. And then I promised him that we, we would play a fun game that I printed off and laminated yesterday. All right. The animals we are most familiar with are vertebrates. All vertebrates have spinal cords and brains, and those are the major parts of their nervous system. Okay. So this is the fun game that we are playing. I printed this out, um, you got it? Mm -hmm. Okay. I printed it out and uh, I will link it below for you guys. But this is the periodic table of elements and then I laminated. So you print four of them and I have two on this side and two on the other side and you just use these little um, paper clips to hold them in place and he has the exact same thing on the other side. We have some um, instructions over there. Anyways, so you just put your ships and it tells you, you know, how many of each, like two two ships, um, two, three ships, one, four ship and one, five ship, like how many spaces. And then this is where you X off if you guessed or not guessed. So anyways, it's pretty fun and it's a great way to kind of review and learn your periodic table of elements. Okay guys, I am going to turn on my computer now. We are done with school, what we're going to do for today. And I actually am just, like I said, I'm loving that new curriculum. Oops allowed. I'm loving that new curriculum. It's Mission World Wonders. I'll link it up here. I did a review. It's amazing and I love it and my son loves it. He has not complained once because he loves the extra science and the history and all that kind of thing. So it's really been great. Um, I, I wish you could see my desk right now. I know I could show you, but to be honest, there's just like a lot of info out. So I'm not going to show you, but it is completely covered in just paper and notebooks and books and all the good stuff that um, is helping me plan for CC this year. So I have my tutor training meeting, not training, tutor meeting tomorrow. So we call like our teachers of our classes, we call them tutors because the teacher is the parent. Um, so I have my tutor meeting tomorrow morning and then um, that's that will be Saturday morning. And then on Monday, I actually have our parent orientation. So I just have papers all over, some on the floor. I've like threatened my kids. I'm like, don't take anything. Don't mess up anything. I just have like organized chaos here. But anyways, I wanted to touch base with you guys because last vlog that I did, um, I talked to you guys about like being involved and getting into helping out with um, youth group at our church uh, because my son is going to be in it this year. And 
I really appreciated some of your feedback. Like it was just super helpful and, and it was like a little bit of a wake up call because I was still in that, you know, like summer phase of like, like the honeymoon phase of summer before school actually starts. <laughs> Anyways, and I was thinking, I was like, maybe I could do Wednesday nights and Sunday mornings. So here is my thought. After I like came down off of cloud nine because I was so excited to help and I am still so excited. Um, there have been a few things throughout the summer that I've helped with and then this weekend is like the start of the Sunday morning youth group. So anyways, I'm super excited. Um, he did go to the first, to the first like Wednesday night activity uh, last Wednesday night and he said he had a good time. So we're probably going to try it. I don't know if he's going to go every Wednesday night. Um, he does have Aikido on Wednesday nights. So I'm not going to push it because they are doing something different where all like the high school and middle school are all together and that hasn't been like that in the past. So, you know, with your first like little baby going into middle school, you're kind of a little bit nervous. And so I am just like, you know what? I'm going to just see how it goes, see what he thinks. If he wants to go, I'm all for it. Um, but if he doesn't, then, you know, we'll, we'll do it next year or whatever. So that is kind of where that lies. I am not going to be helping on Wednesday nights and I think that's the right choice because it's just, it's a lot. Especially as I'm in the planning season of CC, I know it actually gets easier from here, but um, yeah, I think it's a good choice. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to continue drinking my Raisin Cane's lemonade because I love their lemonade. Um, maybe not as much as Chick-fil-A, but I really do love their lemonade. Um, let's see. What else do I need to do? Oh, I need to finish getting all of my tutor prep done for tomorrow. Like all of the prep done for my tutor meeting. That's what I mean to say. Um, I am bringing some like brunch goodies. So I need to get those ordered. I need to go out to the store and get like some juice and things like that. I just need to get everything packed up like in my van and ready to go. Yeah. So this little princess just got home. Let's see, you got some makeup. Oh, gorgeous, darling. I got pink lipstick, but it came off when we started to eat. Oh, you got lipstick. And then you got some eyeshadow. Let me see. Mm, beautiful. And mascara. Oh, my. And look at this little tiara. Did her mommy make these? Mm -hmm. That is super cute. And let's see your hair. Turn, do a spin. Oh, my goodness. It was curled and put up it in a half bun. It was curled and it was put up in a bun. Awesome. And then show me your fingers and toes. Oh, cute. And your toenails. Oh my goodness, beautiful. Did you love it? Was it so much fun? Yeah. And the crown. And the crown is super cute. Oh, thank you. Are you giving it to the phone? <laughs> so lovely. I love that you had so much fun. We came over to the park to play. And my daughter wanted to play for a little bit, so we are just over here playing. I needed a break from computer work anyway. Seriously, it has been quite the last couple of hours. It was basically, I spent an hour of it on the phone and um, didn't get much of my tutor planning done. <laughs> and then, oh my gosh, what else? Um, yeah, it's just, it's that time of year where it's really, really, really busy. It's just the way it is. Okay, you guys, I have to laugh at myself because I'm sitting in my driveway in my van once again. I've been running around like a crazy person today. Um, but I thought it would be kind of fun to see, follow around my busy, crazy day in the life day. Um, because it's not, it's not my norm, that's for sure. Um, yes, so much so that I just literally crashed on the couch for like 20 minutes and... I sat there and I like let my dinner digest. We had leftovers, thank the Lord for leftovers. And um, I just like kind of chilled and closed my eyes and kind of cat napped for a little bit. And then I checked out a book from the library and um, it was a really good one. And so I read just like the little prologue of that and it's gonna be really good is what I meant to say. It's gonna be really good. But I am just, you know, like I'm wearing a white shirt and there's just like, I don't even know what on there. And my hair is just <laughs> a mess. Let's just be honest. Maybe you don't see it as much as I do, but it's a frizzy mess. And um, yeah, I have like a pimple 
it's lovely. So anyways, I was just laughing at myself because I'm like, you know what? It's so funny. I, I, I started the day thinking, you know what? This is going to be a great day to do a day in the life because I have so much to do and I have such a great plan to get it all done. And I made it till about mm, six, six o'clock, which is pretty good. But then I was just like, too much, too much. And with my tutor meeting in the morning, I was like, I can't keep pressing. I can't keep pushing myself to do all this stuff or else I will crash and burn. And then I won't feel like good to do that meeting in the morning. So anyways, I thought I would share that little tidbit with you because this is the way it is this time of year. If you are a director for classical conversations, like there is just so much prep that you have to do and I don't even do as much as other people some people like prep and plan for the whole year I don't even do that because I can't like it makes my brain explode um but there's so much prep and stuff until you actually get to like day one and you bring all your stuff in and you get through like the little opening and then like all the kids go to their classes and it's like you pass off the torch to like your tutors and then you're just like <sighs> so I know it's only for a season and then it will be fine and it won't be so chaotic but there's just like a good solid week where it's like not so and then the rest of the time is just very like th there's a lot of planning and stuff to be done but it's not like as much running around and whatnot so anyways I am going on and on about that because it is it's definitely a reality and um there is just nothing you can do about it to be honest like I've been planning and you know getting geared up all summer and look at this like my hair looks greasy I am not sure what's going on today well whatever whatever so I'm gonna go run some errands actually I'm going back out to run some errands because hallelujah office depot actually has my order in and that I just placed earlier today when I was there so I'm super excited about that and then I also am super excited um, because it's right next to Trader Joe's and I needed to get some items for our tutor meeting in the morning like breakfasty yummy goodness so I'm gonna just pop over to Trader Joe's get everything in one fell swoop and be done so I'm really excited that I am literally doing the very last thing on my list that I had to do today so I'm really excited and I will take you along with me because that's how we do day in the life this is the nature book that or the nature study thing whatever what is it called science journal that I got printed for the little bitty kids so there's lots of extra paper for drawing so those are gonna work out perfectly I'm going to head into Trader Joe's and look at our huge shields that is just being built. So awesome. Oh my goodies from Trader Joe's. Oh, you can't see in the back. We've got a bunch of breakfast goodies. Just wanting to know if any of you guys do this. You can see that it is perfectly light outside, but I am totally sitting in my garage. I pulled in. I'm about ready to put the garage door down, but I just sit in here and take a moment for myself before I go back inside. So I'm just in bed with my girl and... Um, she has a bunch of lipstick on. <laughs> who does? She does. Oh. That's what I was doing. So if you guys watched my, um, what was it? Our, our back to school shopping video. Um, you saw that we bought Natalia a planner. How many weeks ago was that? Was it two weeks ago that we did that? It was, it was just a couple days ago. It wasn't very long ago. It wasn't very long ago, but it was more than a couple days. Yeah. Anyway, <clears throat> she has been loving her planner. And every night we sit in bed and what do we do? We fill that baby out. We fill it up and I think that these are the most like all, all of these. We have a lot on all of this. And after Tigers comes home, she has a bunch of lipstick on. After Teddy comes home, it's church, and then it's mommy's birthday after that because daddy's birthday put a hamburger because he's always so silly to us. And after that, it is one, two, three, four days until CC. And I really like CC, and so I really like it, and I like 
and I like to meet and I like to play with my friends there. So she has been loving that, needless to say, and it's been great calendar practice. So double whammy. Um, anyway, so I'm going to end my vlog here. Thanks so much for watching. And it was a bit of a crazy day. Crazy, crazy. So thanks for watching, guys. And I will catch you in the next one.